Your three minute question and answer period for the TD Entrepreneurship Challenge will now begin. How were you, how were the participants targeted in this project underserved by the current entrepreneurship support system in Canada? So in terms of our um, target participants, we hope that we can create employment opportunity for uh, CBRM residents, especially international students in CBU. But also we also, but besides that, we also want to support like any resident in CBRM if they have a car and they want to have people out there to get their grocery groceries del delivered, then they are more welcome to join our team. And by doing that, we uh they they we expect they will be exposed to entrepreneurship and we hope that we can turn them into the self entrepreneur which is really cool and we we have some plan about that and definitely we will develop if we have a chance and um yeah as i said we providing service to our community members so um i mean it's it's really like the circle of local e economy because uh cape Breton island economy is pretty small and um, we just have to um, make the uh, money flow, cash flow more circulated. Which area of your project do you see as the most innovative and why? Um, I would say um, definitely the bridge that we connect between um, um, uh, our our community members and the job opportunity that uh, we provide to them. Uh, like Mandy mentioned earlier in the previous questions, um, the Cape Breton Regional Municipality economy has been really small and we have a huge problem of low employment rates and low employment opportunities. So the fact that we run the service beside uh, providing um, a contact like grocery service delivered to our community. We also provide uh, job opportunities for our uh, community members, especially um, Cape Breton University students and international students. Because as like mentioned earlier, part-time job and full-time employment opportunities in um, our local economy is pretty rare. How did you define success for this project? Well, um, during our pilot phase, we I, I think we already achieved a, the first step of success by creating a job for 10 volunteer drivers. And also we have five pilot customer, customers and they are all happy about that. And we receive really good feedback from them. And one of our pilot customers- Your time has now expired. Thank you, Enact Escape Breton University.